There we go. Oh, crap. <laughs> wow. Let's give this a good go. Okay, don't get into their line of sight at all. But let them get into mine. Okay, dodge that one. Let's go! Crap, did not see that one coming. Just destroy it for Christ's sake. Die now, please. Don't have to go through this bull crap all the time. Ugh. Why did that barnacle have to snag me? I wouldn't be in this situation if it didn't. There we go. That's one down. Okay, I have 11 health to deal with the other. How is this going to go? I really don't know. Okay. Ouch. That was not good. At all. Oh, crap. Oh dear, he's firing over the top. How the hell am I meant to do this? Am I going to have to reload an earlier save and try it again? Because I seriously can't find any supplies. Okay, I'm tanking it. Go, 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 Freeman, go! Two health points. Two. Two health points. Go, Freeman, do it. No. Nope. I'm going to have to reload an earlier save. Dodge. Good. Right, I'm going into this with one more hit point than I originally had. How will this fare? I really don't know. Might have to redo this whole thing, which will be really annoying. Because this was not meant to be that difficult. In no way was this meant to be very difficult. Alright, I'm tanking it, I'm tanking it, I'm tanking it. I'm tanking it for both now. Nothing tactical whatsoever. Apart from shoot the armoured vehicles. Nothing to 11. Jesus Christ. Why the hell? Come on. Christ. Four hit points. Oh my god. Do it, Freeman. There we go. Ah. Oh. Okay, I'm saving. I do not want to have to do that again. If I die stupidly for whatever reason. <sighs> anyway. Let's get out of this. And let's go into under this uh, this bridge type thing. Because what we're going to need to do is we're going to need to get the airboat in here. And to do that we need to bust open this entrance. Okay. I'm on way too little health that is even safe to continue. Supplies. Oh my god. Thank you for the health. Oh, that feels good. Oh, that's amazing. And that wasn't suggestive in any way. At all. Anyway, let's continue. I need to go up that ramp and go into that tube. There we go. And emerge on the other side. And continue this way. Yeah, it's this way. And another loading screen. I know it'll auto save here, so I don't need to worry about anything. So that's good. And that loading screen was very short lived. And now, right here, we're going to have the epic battle of epic proportions with that chopper, that hunter chopper that the guy at that base was talking to us about. So now I am up to uh, full health again. We can actually do this. Now right here we're nearing the end of, uh, of Water Hazard. But let's not get complacent. Let's fight this fight like a man. We, we just need to destroy this helicopter. Now I would explode all of these exploding barrels uh, before um, before you try to engage with the chopper because if you don't it'd be seriously bad because if the chopper does fire at those and you're near them you will take serious damage and the whole fight is merely just about evasive maneuvers and not getting hit and where the hell has it gone? there it is see it's using exactly the same gun that we're using and we're using exactly the same gun that it's using 
Okay, now when you hear that alarm, this thing is going to start doing uh, doing something a little bit different. It's going to start carpet bombing. I think. Or is it not just yet? Have I not damaged it enough yet? I thought it was that alarm that signifies it. Yeah, there it is. This is its carpet bombing formation. When you when it starts doing that, you know that the fight's just about half done. When it does start doing that, you want to get the flip out of the way of everything. Because you do not want to get struck by any of those bombs. Now, luckily, I'm not losing too much health here. So I'm going to fight this out from a distance. That was okay. Just maneuver. Oh, there's some energy right there. Lovely. I need some energy. Energy. Energy is what I need. And now let's keep firing at him. I assume it's a him piloting it. I don't know why, but I just do. And then let's... Uh, well, what am I saying? A little bit more should do it. There we go. Oh, crap. <laughs> wow. I mean, we defeated him, but... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's one way of doing it. Anyway, we need to uh, get this thing open. And that means uh, doing undoing another valve. I see what you did there. Well, not a valve, just turning another wheel. Don't know where I got a valve from. Oh yeah, the people who made the game. <laughs> so let's do that. And there we go. And I really didn't need to go down that ladder, but I did anyway. So let's continue through here, and we need to go up this ramp. That is right here. Perfect. Turning, perfect orientation. And here we are. Let's just get up onto the... B Actually, no, you know what? I could probably take out some of the CPs from here. Yeah, I think that's that for those on the exterior. That was worth it. Anyway... Let's continue. And we need to go into this building. Where there are a bunch of others. And we believe it or not need to take them out. And we just did that very, very easily. So that's good. And while we are up here, there are tons of supplies right here. Which we can pick up. Which is just absolutely fantastic. As most things are. And it's not like I need that health station anymore, because I've, I've now got 100 on everything. Just from doing that little bit of fill up. And now once we've done that, we can continue on to this area. This area, it's basically what you've seen before, and you might have just seen G-Man over there, walking along the catwalk. We missed him, so I don't know why I bothered to zoom in, but, you know, he's there. So, speeding along here. And then, uh... Do I need to press something to drop the ladder? I do. I was going down the wrong ladder anyway. Wait, hold on. What? Oh, it drops this one as well. Wait, that one's already there. Was it? I can't remember. This is all just weird. Anyway, continuing along this very um, predictable journey. We cannot pull that, but we can pull this. Once we pull that, that will open the gate that we need to use in order to get back to, uh, well, to get to the next area. Now, that lever actually drops this ladder, which would normally take you down to that uh, battleground again, but I stupidly left my airboat over there. So uh, I'm going to have to run all the way back to go and get it, which is just fantastic. Here it is. Let's hop back on. And we need to go back to the previous area, to the previous battleground. Or to THE battleground, more like. And okay. What is through here? Nothing much. We basically need to gain as much speed as we can. And we need to speed up this ramp in order to access the next area to go through that hole. Yeah, We made it! Oh, just. And a loading screen. Just as we plunge headfirst into a body of water. Where else would you put a loading screen? Nowhere! Of course, only the most tense moments get loading screens. We all know that. We all know that. And we have got to the next chapter, Black Mesa East. So I'm going to say thank you very much for watching, everyone. We will continue our adventures here in Black Mesa East in the next video. 
be sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel if you are new and I will see you in episode number nine. Goodbye.